uh, I know him and that is how I reach to the, that's how I know you, right? So the connection goes like this. I stay very close to your place, Malkajigiri. And uh, this is a road which I used to take maybe thousands of times, must have driven here. Because every alternate day I used to go to Ramakshna Mat for teaching there. And that's where I learned my uh, teaching profession, probably. Because we had lakhs of students, lakhs of parents, many organizational programs which they used to conduct. I used to be one of the faculty members. I feel great because I am part of one of the greatest organizations in India, which is that. Which is one of the greatest organizations of India. Eh? Now, I feel great because I am from ISRO. Right? So, ISRO has a very specific rule, not government rule. Anybody knows this? Eh? ISRO rules are not government rules. There is one man who wrote rules for ISRO. Eh? Hmm? No, Vikram Sarabhai made the institute under one condition, the head office has to be in Bangalore. The secretary of the department generally will be in Delhi. When he made an institute, he made one uh, demand. Space secretary will not sit in Delhi. Space secretary will sit in Bangalore. All the secretaries of the department has to sit over Delhi. But there is only one department for which the secretary sits in Bangalore because it's a scientific man, not an IAS. Fine? One. But then, a IAS works under him as a government uh, nominee <coughs> and that's Joint Secretary. Love. And for one of the Joint Secretary, the strongest Joint Secretary was T.N. Shesha. You know T.N. Shesha? T.N. Shesha was our General Secretary. Then, first assignment given to T.N. Shesha was write to rules for Department of Space. So, he made rules. And that was submitted to the Prime Minister and said, this will be our rule. So, we have a different rule. The government money comes to Department. Department will give it to every sender. Every sender, when the money comes to Director, he will give it to all the Departments, under sections. And the section can, don't have to take any sanction for spending money. I can decide how my money is spent. But one condition that we are all responsible. And 20 years in my department, I never signed my attendance. No attendance register. We had a different rule. No attendance register. I was the first employee in the office which started in Hyderabad. Being the first employee, we never had an office. So we were in GD Metline, a rented uh, sub-building of NRSC. So I have seen how the organization comes up. I was the first canteen secretary, I was the first recreation secretary, because everything was started by us. But then I didn't stay there for more than few years. After a few years, I found it's not a good place. I left to headquarters. Bangalore, where we have got program planning and project management. That means the whole ISRO, how much fund is allocated, and who will become head of ISRO, an HR project was done. Then I came back and then went to education, then went to Prime Minister's office. It would have been good to stay there and then do only research. We are mainly into software development and research. But then I went out, moved out, seen different parts. As part of it, I have gone to many of the banks. That's how I meet a lot of people. Last week I was in Kuwait, completed uh, all the Indian schools in Kuwait, all the teachers. Not that teachers are not bad, teachers are good. 
but there is a small change which can make them better so one of the schools we learned from many people so one lesson which i learned last week from one of the senior most teacher she is 71 year old kuwait has got an exception or all the gulf has got exception here after 60 they cannot continue as principal but the exemption is given she was there before the war during war she came and again kuwait invited all the management to restart the school you know that how many of you have seen the tire lift movie seen the problem right so that was a real problem there. so they were explaining all that that's my first visit to kuwait one of the management said many people join as teachers with a lot of enthusiasm but then after few they will think not that much change can be done the system is like that parents are like this students are like this what difference i make right let me continue like this get my salary at home that's good enough and do you know what most of the people will shift from one school to another school there are few teachers who continue for 23 30 years and then become principal there was one principal who shifted seven schools in the last 20 30 years there are few teachers who continued in the same organization for 23 and uh, teaching is one profession where once you get into you cannot get any other job there are some of some jobs once you get into that you are unfit for any other job teaching is such a profession so i am coming from that experience every day i get lot of whatsapp messages i was just sharing one of the whatsapp message from one of the btech student i was in engineering college who got into a bank he is in bombay i'm sure bombay life is little tougher than hyderabad life how many of you lived in bombay quite a few sir. quite a few right? our head office is there yeah <laughs> bombay life is better or hyderabad life is better yes <laughs> bombay life eh bombay is better here it is lethargic retired life bombay you cannot walk i keep saying no you cannot walk you have to run so you will be always you know fast but for us i am from a small village bombay life is too hectic instead of that delhi or maybe pune pune is pune also has become busy now earlier pune used to be a retired life now mysore is only there bangalore also has become too busy so life has to be cool or uh, fast life has to be cool or fast so life has to be happy first of all it's cool you are married you have got permission to share that you have taken permission to share that where do you get happiness where do you get happiness from happiness eh happiness are you happy sometimes eh sometimes we feel happy sometimes no always you want to be happy see sometimes there is some previous question is also required no always you want to be happy no sir Yes, definitely not you want always to be happy yes. don't want to be in himalayas so they are very happy and <laughs> <laughs> we want to yeah the sir satisfaction that is happy okay if you are satisfied yes. if you are satisfied and if every most of us are satisfied we will never work yes. development comes from unsatisfaction got it you need desire i want to grow i want to grow every rich man want to be richer right i also worked with one of the richest man 
who makes palaces in Gulf is a Kerlet. He owns 700 acres of land in Kochi. He's a great builder. Bangalore, he has got a Shoba developers, one of the greatest builders. All the Infosys buildings are constructed by him without a quotation. You understood? Without a quotation means? That's a contract to yes. You don't have to give quote. The contract is given to him. You can design and build and then give it to us. And he also maintains it for 10 years. You see, most of the Infosys building has got inner cycle only. No vehicle is allowed and all that. No, that's all because of him. You will see same tiles every Infosys building. Same clock. Everything is fixed by the builder. His PNC man. I worked with him for one and a half, two years on a CSR project. He says always take anything from me except a calculator. Because his life is money. 2020, how much? In the richest person, 2020, I'll become 13th man. Like that, he keeps on adding. It's true. He's a very, very Assume he stops earning, you know how many families will, or he, I'm satisfied and good enough. No. So one of the blessings which is given to every good student by a teacher, what is that? Never get satisfied with your knowledge. The richest person by themselves are not satisfied. Only one place you should get satisfied is on your dining table. Right? After the food, little more and say enough. There is only one place where people have to say enough. That's while eating. I think rest of the places, money-wise, no. Everybody needs more. Happiness-wise, everybody needs more. Knowledge-wise, everybody needs more. Fame. Chandra Babu Naidu was very famous. Right? Great chief minister. But once he lost election, I am sure he must not have seen the paper for long years, months. You know? Because earlier, every day, first page, his picture will come. When the new chief minister comes, whose picture will come? Do you think seeing his own picture five years on every newspaper, that's a task given to PR. Every day, my... No? Instead of that, if third page, his picture comes and first page, Home Minister's pictures come, finished. That day, every proposal given by Home Minister, he will reject. Because once you become famous, it's very difficult. Have you ever gone to any uh, politician's house? Huh? You know what do they keep? Big picture of their own big flux they will keep. They will look at it and say, yeah, I have to be this big every day. <laughs> Their aspirations are becoming famous, including some Swamiji's. They, they call for a lecture, they will tell, no, my flux has to be this size. <coughs> they will uh, start demanding. There are a lot of people. A lot of people, they will say, minimum this much people are required, otherwise I will not come. And there are ashrams where they get people from different places and made them to sit there. They may, may not know who is this person. No? That's also done. Because number of people is proportional to the fame, the fund which they can collect from different places. All these happens. They are not satisfied. Swamiji's are supposed to be satisfied, but they are not satisfied. You know, morning you will see some TV programs. The preachings by the Swamiji's. You know how much they pay to the TV channel? The TV channel half an hour is purchased for marketing them. If they are satisfied, why do they come on to the channel? Now, their own channel also is a business, right? Not their own channel, there are people who come on to different channels, no? All of them pay. The prime time, TV time is nearly 50,000 rupees. You will see on the bottom it's written. This program, this episode is 
sponsored by because they know if they invest this much they will get it's all because most of them once you get a either money or knowledge or fame if you become satisfied there is no progress in the world or power fame is power power position fame everything is same once you act in a movie as a hero next movie if you get a second role most of the cinema stars are unsatisfied because they cannot you know they cannot once you become a hero two times or three times in a movie fourth movie if somebody comes with a second role it's actually shame so that's why some of them will not even take a hero's role they will always become second role because that is sustainable so they are unsatisfied so don't ever get satisfied in life it's a good blessing or bad blessing eh you understood the present job if you are satisfied the present salary you are satisfied present activity you are satisfied i'm sure finished no progress in life are you satisfied okay let me ask you you are either a wife or a husband or a son or a brother or a sister how much mark you will give it to you rate you as a how good a husband you are 100 out of 100 how good a wife you are 100 out of 100 how good a son you are how good a son you are for your parents for your brothers and sisters are you 100% good how much you will give to your children my son is 100% good my daughter is 100% good how you rate them don't you have to that determines your happiness we say i am unhappy with you my son correct i am unhappy with you my daughter i am unhappy with subordinate i am unhappy with my boss does it not happen hmm? don't you have to weigh yourself to check whether weight is perfect so that don't is it not done all the parameters are measured by a doctor when you go to a hospital physical parameters and they say that no these parameters are not perfect you need to improve on this you need to improve on right how do we rate our relationships emotional attachment to people my social interaction if you have to do it then we become a real human being it's only physical <coughs> fitness is what is required i think it's all animals and human beings are same so what is the difference between a human being and an animal the difference is we have personal interaction we have this feeling of mine my family how close i am with the my people around me how do they rate me how do i rate them all these are essential to evaluate once you evaluate we know how to improve thinking itself is good enough i am sure most of you are not telling your rate but already you must have thought yeah this is not good enough i ask my children when i go to students you know how good is you to your parents generally they rate between 50 60 i ask a question back how good is your father 
or mother. Immediately there is a hundred percent. I started this accidentally. In Delhi, I was sitting with a small child. There is a Guru Ayurvedic temple in Mayur Vihar. That's where I used to sit in the evening. A small child with grandmother every day used to come to the temple. So I asked the small child, "How good is your father?" Immediately he said, "Zero." Mother, zero. Grandmother, hundred percent. Grandfather, ninety ninety. Now who takes care of the child? Grandmother. Very clear. And what does grandmother do all the time? Says very good things about his mother and father, and that is how all the information. It's not he. I'm sure he is not. Good enough to evaluate his father, but that is how. So I think everybody evaluates. Even a small child, he was only three, three and a half, four years old, kg. That's it. So we have to evaluate ourselves to improve in our life. So don't ever get satisfied, because I'm sure you are not hundred percent good husband. You are not hundred percent good wife. There is a scope for improvement. Okay, assume that you improve. Do you think after some some time you will get dissatisfied? That time also same. Can't do it. What is that? Never get satisfied. Because assume you reach into one level. Today you think becoming that is great. Before getting job, what was your aim? Somehow I want to get a job, right? And then what? Then to enjoy, you want to take leave, right? <laughs> the immediate things I want to go home and enjoy with my family. Maybe three months you had no work. If you ask somebody, what are you doing now? Waiting for result. What? I have done my MBA. What are you doing? Waiting for result. Three months they wait for result. Every day wait for result. As if they keep saying you are an MBA. You have nothing else to do for three months in your life after MBA. You are unfit to get a job. Correct? All of us we keep thinking after getting a job. What is the first plan? Yes. After getting a job, what is next? Satisfied? No. Then what? Get married. Right? Getting married is satisfied. Which is the greatest marriage happened this last one week? Nineteenth May. Eh? Hey? The royal marriage. The so second marriage. His wife is four years older. And her second marriage, right? They are happy. Every day marriage day, everybody is happy, right? That day focus is on you. Lot of pictures. In life only one day most of the people become heroes and heroine. Correct or not? You are not happy now or happy? What is your next objective? My children should get educated. For what? First KG classes for children. Then getting them into admission for the higher studies. That becomes your happiness or tension? Eh? Tension only. Yeah. Why this tension? Yeah, because you are not satisfied. You are not satisfied with their performances. Is there anybody a bus, a coffee, or you want to get into IIT? 
Gives. Hotani. Every time you want to go higher and higher. But for everybody it doesn't happen. Assume you don't get it. Everything is lost in life. Hmm? How many of your classmates or how many of our classmates got the best job as you all got? How many of them? Eh? I am from a small village. I am the only one government servant in the whole 10th class batch. Nobody else. I went back to that place maybe after 30, 31 years now to rebuild my old house. And few of them who are working in my house as laborers, my taxi driver was my own classmate. I call him because let me give some portion of you know, job to him. My watchman, my servant maid in my house, happened to be my brother's classmate. Not everybody is gifted. But then once we get a job, we say, no, it's not a good job. I also left my job, you know, I took my retirement. Space department is great. You know Abdul Kalam? He jumped from space department. Went to defense department. Dear Dio. Kyo? Space department achha nahi. He thought de defense is better. Whatever he learned in space department can be immediately used in defense department. Because it's almost like a sister concern. We send a satellite to space, they send missile to one place to another place. That's the difference. Same fear, same place. The missile filling is also done in the, the same, same place it is done. Same mechanism. But then, he could jump into different... If he was satisfied, I am sure, he will not be called as missile man, right? So what is extra for him? What is extra for him? And why he could do it, you know? came to the point. <laughs> I kept saying, Buddha became Buddha because he was, a, he was not a bachelor. He left his wife, right? Forced to bachelor. Forced to bachelor. But you know Lord Shiva? You know Lord Shiva? Who is more powerful? One of the most powerful goddesses is Shakti. Shiva's wife, right? There is a big paradox in his Shiva's house. Shiva has got a snake and one of his son has got a peacock. Right? Four. Six. Eight, nine, ten. Was this easy or uh, mouth was easier? Mouth was easier, right? How many of you could get just below the nose? Raise your hands. Only this many? Many liars are here, yeah? <laughs> huh? Good. Now, you can just tilt so that when you stretch your arms, you will not touch your neighbor. So, I said 45 degree turn. Then lift it up, touch your finger to finger like this. At least you know that you have a rib, many of you closed with a lot of fat. Touch it like this. Are you able to? Yes or no? Put it down, look down, close your eyes. Now, I am going to count. You have to do it. <laughs> and one, when I say seven, if it's like this, don't adjust. No adjustment. This is getting recorded. I'll check who are the cheaters here. Okay? You can turn like this and then throw a turn around. 45 degree. So that you don't touch. Right? If you want, try once again. If you are not done 
एक दो बार ट्राई कर सकते हो फाइन या लुक डाउन स्लोली डोंट एडजस्ट है जीरो थ्री फाइव सेवन एट नाइन डोंट एडजस्ट टेन If you have done an adjustment, I will call you individually and in front of everybody you. You have one inch gap, two inch gap. For some people, Adi Buddhi. Some people, Vakra Buddhi. See, it's not that easy, no? Because every day we do this. This your own finger doesn't know where the other finger is. It's on your own body. Why? There is only one reason we don't practice. So what we do in our life is what we practice. Anything in our life. How many of you get up as soon as you wake up? Get up as soon as you wake up. Don't you have a... पांच मिनट दस मिनट वो हो जाते हाफ एन आवर भी हो जाते वेरी अर्जेंट मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम राइट और सम पीपल आर लाइक दैट मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम दे आर लेट सो एज दे वेक अप देर टू गेट एंड रन है सीन यंग चिल्ड्रन बेबी so cute a different smell as soon as they get up you feel like hugging them they are so chubby you know so energetic you look at yourself as soon as you get up how you are <laughs> see when you have long rest after that when you wake up how you should be fresh fresh but instead of that what are we becoming ugly you know why that's why vivekananda said tushni bhavam many people waste the time on bed the long you waste that much ugly you are young children as soon as they wake up what do they do look at every dog does it every animal does it so tomorrow you want to change as soon as you get up look at the mirror and say yeah i am so cute you want this yes or no yes drink 3 liters of water before going to bed tonight tomorrow is saturday yeah this is our problem tomorrow is saturday day after tomorrow sunday monday se shuru karenge मंडे क्यों नेक्स्ट मंथ से शुरू करेंगे वही जून जुलाई नहीं है तो जनवरी से शुरू करेंगे अभी 48 हो गया आफ्टर 50 आई विल बिकम फिट आई यूज टू से नो इवनिंग वी मॉर्निंग वी गिव लॉट ऑफ आसनास एंड से विल शो यू हाउ टू बिकम फिट सर मैं कल इवनिंग से भी फिट है This is our problem because basically human beings are lazy. There is one reason we have got a vertical body, right? The blood which flows in our body is highly non-Newtonian. It doesn't listen to Newton rule. Ghee, a kaise rata ghee? You take one mug of ghee and then pour it. Will it flow immediately? water immediately it flows therefore ghee is more non newtonian it thinks it knows i am inside this vessel let me take rest after some time only i wake up so blood is also like that it's not our problem we are manufactured like that but you know chandra babu naidu we were discussing i am the person who brought many kerala festivals to hyderabad 2003 october we have got a program i wanted some program to happen in the necklace road that time necklace road was under construction so 
some area were cleaned up for our program i got three elephants three big boats 84 feet wala big boats transported from kerala in between there was a government program in the same end so i wanted to change that program i went to chandrababu naidu i took an appointment the time given was 2:40 am say so 2:40 am he has to give an appointment either he must be sleeping after that or he must be up before 2:30 got it that's how they work that's how they are chief ministers so we we take life as very light think that everything is possible this much struggle is not to be done no if we travel 4 hours in a flight as we come back we have got jet lag if jet lag is there for modi <laughs> 365 days come out huh? probably that is the reason east to west he will fly to compensate jet lag he must be flying from west to east again back <laughs> possible you know immediately after delhi airport he takes the next flight goes to gujarat next meeting and they are all energetic the more energetic you become when you use this body maximum it's almost like elasticity the rubber band which you keep on using it has got elasticity without use kidhar bhi rakhe to kya hota next time when you take it toot jata hai na yes or no buddhi is like that why is it not yeah you don't remember few things why you don't remember huh why you don't remember have you seen the priest in the temple Eh? the speed in which they chant the mantra how do they know this because every day they practice 7 years is the time when the vedas are being taught eh? but we take it for granted not required this is good enough you gave a nice word that's where i started satisfied good enough why should i worry ya tanka to aa jate family is happy bhai many eh he is saying that so when do you eat the khana ha ha aur do roti milta hai shanti se khao good this from our side yeah <laughs> good enough see everybody everybody in the world should not become when i have got lot of students who are ias aspirants somebody will come i want to become ias i said don't try you don't sir i want to become see everybody become ias what will happen they also need a driver they also need a <laughs> clerk they also need right so we have to have different category you know when uh, rama and sita were walking they found lot of people poor people maybe when you read ramayana you understand those days we had poorest of the poor people in bharat india is much better today modi is a better ruler than dasharatha that's how we feel when we read mahabharata ramayana all those time we had lot of problems biggest war mahabharata we don't have such war today we are much better correct sita asked why do you want these people to be poor why can't you make them rich then rama said the world rule is we need poor people we need educated uneducated the police have job only when there is thief if there is no thief what police will do so everybody is required here then there was a big argument then always ladies win that fine i will listen to you so make them rich tadhastu finished everybody become rich after few days house was not clean there was leakage nobody is attending then sita came with a complaint saying that this is not everybody is rich who will come for this small job got it so there has to be problems in the world then only you get job correct there has to be unsatisfied people then only progress happens there has to be problems in the world if problems are not there no mountain is there river cannot flow there has to be ups and downs there has to be readers if everybody becomes poet no readers everybody become actors 
no viewers. When I ask how many of you want to become doctors, there will be a lot of hands up. Immediately ask, how many of you want to become patients? Nobody. I said, no job for these people, no. Correct? There has to be patients. Then only doctors have got. What is the doctor's prayer in the morning? Patients are high. He will do extra puja. Tirupati, kitne bar jate ho? What for? What is the police? If police meets you and then say, come, you uh, know? What does it mean? Every now and then you can come to my station means what? An advocate says, uh, let us meet every once in a while. That means you have cases, right? Correct or not? So, sab ke liye problem hai. Problem hona hai. The world is with a lot of problems. Tell me, is the, you know, the traffic police is powerful job or not? Traffic, traffic, so traffic police signal pe rehta na? You can stop everybody. No? You can send the people. But assume you are watching that man for some time. Do you think you want to be a powerful position standing on the street doing all this gym, gym? Eh? You know there is a story. One traffic police was doing it and his hands were pain. He want to go for this. Possible for him? Eh? In between, let all the things stop, I will go and come back. Is it possible for him? It's a very difficult job, you know, unless some substitute comes. Today there is no problem because everything is automated signal. But he was seeing one postman who was going and he found that that's a better job. Then he can walk everywhere. This post, I can only stand all the time. Watch, this man can walk. Who was seeing a postman going, he found the postman enters in a compound a dog was barking and coming. He said, no, this job is not good. Because he has to go into different places. You don't know what is going to happen there. He is, tries to compare him for different jobs. Ultimately, he says, this is the most powerful. <coughs> Everybody thinks the next job, the other job, other job is good. Correct? Which job is best? Which job is best in the world? Chief Minister's job is good? Uh, Baba. Prime Minister? Eh? Baba. Hassan. Teaching. Teaching is good? Nobody is saying never. Teaching is good? <laughs> Your job is good? Yes, Why? That is fine. Why? Why your job is good? What's great about your job? Tell me what's great about your job. No, no, that's a very generic one. <coughs> now you have got 13 years of service or 15 years of service. Tell me what great thing you have done. Think about it for a while. See, as a mother, as a father, as a family person, you have got one moment to say that, no, this day I did this. This decision was great. Marrying this person was a great decision. Diversing this person was a great decision. There could be a lot of moments. What is the great thing you have done? As a person, if somebody asks, this is my greatest moment in my life. Is there anything which you can mark? Is there anything which you can mark, say that, this is my greatest moment in this bank? Think. You know what is credit in a life? Credit in a life is to say how many moments which you created in your life which makes you to feel pride. I've got a lot of great moments in my life. It need not be a great thing, but I feel that I have done something great in my life. Is there any such moments? Evaluate yourself and say that, yeah, I have done this. You understood? I remember TN Session visiting us, the small office, and then we were trying to explain we are the best in this. You know, immediately asked, best in Secunderabad, best in Andhra Pradesh, best in India. Immediately he said, 
similar work is done in Netherlands, this place, and they are much better than you. Don't say we are one of the best. One of the best means you should tell who are. He knows most of the subject he knows. If we work with such people, we had that opportunity to meet them, talk to them. Narlekar, the greatest astrophysics man. Hmm? Jain Narlekar. I sat in his class not on astronomy. He's a great astronomy man where he could have got Nobel Prize. But he taught how to build an organization. His lecture was on how to build an organization. Not only expert in one subject, different subjects. So he keeps saying, what is that you want to be in your life? What is your aim? Do you want to head a great organization? You want to start a new organization? Where do you get this experience of making such a great organization? TN Shashan made a rule. He would have been a normal IAS. When people ask who is the election commissioner, we remember only one. Correct? Yes or no? Yes. Do you know how many of you heard Bajpay's talk in parliament and all? Once he became prime minister, he became prime minister and Indira Gandhi was sitting there. You know, the first he stood up and then started his speech, he said, Bhuhumana Pratana Mantri Ji. Who was the Prime Minister? He himself. Because all these years he was opposition leader. And Indira Gandhi was Prime Minister. The day he became Prime Minister, oh, Bhul Gaya. Eh? Bhuhumana Pratana Mantri Ji. Everybody started laughing. Then he realized, yeah, something wrong. The respect was that much. No? He was a great man. Being in opposition, you can't see him scolding, going, talking, anything against the government. Because his commitment was to India, then to the party. He kept saying, if that happens, I am blaming my own country. Got it? That's a commitment, yes. So, that's a respect we should have. But you heard Deve Gouda speaking, the last speech of Deve Gouda as a Prime Minister. When he stood up, everybody started making noise. Then he said, don't respect me, but at least respect this chair where Indira Gandhi sat, Nehru sat. <laughs> Imagine some Prime Minister has to beg for Respect. Respect. What a is why why it has happened like that? Because he himself became unfit to sit in the <laughs> understood. There is a Mari Chennaradi Institute for yeah. yeah. I used to go there to give lectures. Almost every week I used to be there for most of the training programs. Most of the government employees have got one complaint, sir. AEC pay last Pandra Sal say hey promotion nahi hai. I said, very good. Abhi ho bol raha hai. Very good. Yeah, very good. If you are not happy, quit the job. See, promotion nahi hai. Tanka kam hai. Kya karna hai? Quit the job. Oh, sir, if I quit the job, I will not get any other job. So you know 100% you are useless. <laughs> No organization will keep you here, right? But still this organization is keeping. Ah, sir, I'm happy now. <laughs> See, I'll tell you, uh, the great organization I started to talking about is Ro. When I did an HR, human resource program on HR, best seniors like directors, NRSC, we have got a director, 17 years we were the director. He told that the productivity of my office, that means it has got more than 3,000 scientists. Productivity is 20 percentage. If that can be made 100 percentage, 70 percentage, you know the country will become great. Why is it not? Then later when we made this, it was an oral interview. We typed it and sent him for correction. You know what he did? I was there. 20, shall I make it 25? 
He was doubtful whether to make it 25. I said, why can't you make it above 50? No. I am sure my organization works more than 50 percentage. Ability here, but they don't do it. Why they don't do it? It's enough, good enough. All of us feel it's good enough. That's where this country is not. Organizations, individuals have to think this is not enough. We need it. We have sensory organs. We have two eyes. Two eyes we see so many things. But we need an extra eye to see some unseen things. What is that requirement? If anybody who develops in this world is only people who have got one extra eye. How many of you have seen Dear Zindagi movie? Mary Cop. Eh? How many of you have seen Super Super Secret Star? Eh? The original name is Secret Superstar, but I keep saying Super Secret Star. It is great thing to learn from them. They had an extra eye, they had an extra ear. We all have, but we don't use it. I think I will not speak further. I want all of you to clap. Clap. So, how many of you clapped 100% sincerely? With all your energy, did you? I am 100% sure none of you. Though you can clap, this man asked me to clap. Anyway, he is going out. In life, I don't have to see him. Why should I listen to him? He is not paying me. Correct or not? He cannot stop my salary. Correct or not? We don't do anything 100%. Though we can do it. I will tell you why did I ask you to clap. Once lecture is over, oh mandatory clapping. Kyo? Koi so ra hoga. Usko bolna hai, khatam ho gaya, chalo. No. You know the reason? Not your ear. The whole body is listening to lectures. Don't think two nose is breathing. Every inch of your body is breathing. Sensory organs are not this. There is a skin in your body which also is a sensory organ. Seeing and listening and hearing is different from not seeing and listening, right? Correct or not? When you are hearing a radio drama, you are visualizing. We say we are seeing. We are only hearing, but we are seeing internally. So many things happen internally. The whole body is your hand. This is your head. Have you seen people when they get tension, you do this? Also bite? Only this. No other finger. That's because A, Hamara head. This is our hand. When we have to think, we keep our hand on your head. Correct? Keep the hand on your head. Keep the hand on your head. This is called Chin Mudra. Nana Mudra. So when you keep it like this, you get more concentration. It's hand on the brain. These are your legs. You close your eyes and rub here. You can rub your tummy inside. Your back pain can be cured from this. Your leg pains can be cured by pressing here. This is your, this is your heart. You can hold the heart, between the heart, like this. You can get the heartbeat of your neighbor. Close your eyes and hold. You can get the heartbeat of the neighbor. Try. If your heart is here, you are given to somebody else, not possible. Very simple, you get it. Once you press here, your headache can be cured. 
So when you clap, what are you doing? What are you doing? The whole body is getting energized. Got it? See whether you can shake your whole body with the... You don't have to run, you don't have to do all that. You can clap well, it's as good as taking a good exercise. Now clap. Clap, continue. Clap. Jump. Now you did slightly better. <laughs> because first I said clap, now I added some Benefit. <laughs> benefit. When some benefit comes, okay, then let me try. It's for me, not for somebody else. Correct? Now there is another method for people to do hard work. You want to know that? Eh? Yeah. Carrot. Eh? Carrot. Yeah. Not carrot. That is first. That is done. Now still you have not done 100%. Because some people... Yeah, I gave a lecture in one of the medical colleges. You don't want to get a heart attack, get every day morning, 5 o'clock and do exercise. I am a meditation master from Himalayas. Meditation, you have to do yoga, karna hai. Then he said, oh, after 60 years, uh, heart attack, na? Kal kare. After 30, 40, I will do. Why now? Do you know when you are going to heart get heart attack? Is there any guarantee? Eh? Today, my son was telling his professor who is 38 years old. Indian Institute of Social Sciences. Good morning. He was one of the best professor who made me interested in doing research and all he was telling. 38 years. Good enough. I went to uh, Kuwait, Indian school. One lady, she was 28 or 30. She was talking to her husband who is in Kerala. On the phone while she was talking, she was telling, I am feeling uncomfortable. Finished. Collapsed. Any, any day it can come. Last moment you think about me. That's what Lord Krishna says. So cunning. What is that? Last moment you think about me. Then the next question is, do you know when is your last moment? You don't. Therefore, always you think about me. <laughs> you don't know when are you going to. Right? So as long as you live, Nimisham Jolitam Sreyam. Don't be lazy and become inactive. Be very active. All this carrot motivation will not work. Fine? If your hands are not red, I am going to come to you and make your cheeks red. Punishments, you know, sometimes. I will give you notice, otherwise do this. Let us see how many of you can do well. Carefully. When I fold my finger like this, single clap. Ready? Yes? Ready? Ready? Later. Single. Fast. See, now you have done very good. You know why? I said only once you do it. Earlier what I said? You know that I have to clap five times. Then let No, five times I have to do it now. So I will do slow. Anything repeated we take, relaxed. Once you have to do, you will do it. No difference. Same person, when I said once what you did, you could also clap like this. You didn't do it. How did you do? Jor se kiya. Kyo? Eki bar karna hai na? This is the problem. Anything repeated gets bored. How do you become different, improvised, innovative in your office? Think what difference I can make. Don't be the same every day. If you feel that every day is same, life becomes boring. Correct? Every day is different. Every day is different. World is different. Your age is different. The people who are interacting is different. His mood and her mood is different. Therefore, I am a different person every day. Don't think same Naba tomorrow when you come. Think it's a new, different office. Right? Because today night you could become Krishna Rama Govinda. Nobody knows. Tomorrow is a great day. It's a chance given to us. Correct or not? Anything can happen? 
Nothing happened. And who calls you in the morning? Brahma calls you. Who is Brahma's wife? Saraswati, with a lot of knowledge. Kyomara either? Lakshmi Bulara. Hey, Lakshmi se ke saath kon ne hote? Action, kaam karna hai. Then evening, meditative sleep, I can peacefully sleep. Right? I've got a poetry book. Did I give anything last time? No. Millions of sperm from the father get into the mother's egg and only one sperm take birth and that's me. Millions of sperm from the father get into the mother's egg and only one sperm take birth and that's me. How many sperms did not take birth? Millions. Who are they? My unborn brothers and sisters. Isko jenmi nahi mila. Eki atmi kyo mila? O kone? Me. So lift your hands up. Take it back and say well done. You are not one person. You came to this world huh, raising millions of your unborn brothers and sisters. We have a great job to do. If you are not performing well, it's a great injustice to all unborn brothers and sisters. Is it not good enough? That's my poetry. Right? Everybody has got a lot of potential. Hey, but make your karma. Aram se. Aram se nahi rena. Because the more you work, your elasticity will improve. Physically will become better, emotionally become balanced, intellect become great, socially become active, spiritually become great. Five-fold development. That's what is required. Bas, if you have some questions, probably I can answer. Yeah. Could ask me. Anybody? Uh, Five minutes. Have any questions? Uh, general. General, I came to your house. You have seen some people coming. A encyclopedia. Okay, then close the window. No, I don't want. I saw, I saw marketing person. If you don't ask questions. Yeah. No. Closer to God means no. God ultimately don't take next birthday. No, they did not understand. Hridaya Guhara Madhya Kevalam Brahma Matram. Everyone who takes birth comes with God in himself. God is not somebody outside. Hridaya Guhara Madhya Kevalam Brahma Matram. Inside your Hridaya you have a God. God is not outside. Okay. So you are you, within you there is a God. You are not aim is not to reach God. Which everybody asks is now what is the purpose of your birth actually? Yeah, that has to be defined. I am born, I am born in this universe. Uh, you said I am born with some online physics or some millions of unborn brothers and sisters now. Okay, now why I have got a birth of all the people because this is one soul which needs to go to the God ultimately without taking next birth actually. Okay, sir. Now my question is uh, no. Uh, once you made once you made a statement, if I agree only, the question exists. Your condition, hypothesis itself is wrong. No, I have, let me put it on side. Yeah. Okay, sir. My question is, uh, is it so, uh, this is one soul, uh, which is not getting birth, actually, because it is not materialistic. No. See, there is a lot of confusion among people. There are a lot of people who come to TV, give bhashan. They have not even read Ashtanga Yoga, eight steps. Yama, Niyama, Asana, Pranayama, Pratyahara, Dharana, Dhyana, Samadhi. Reaching to Samadhi, eight steps. The first step, second step, third step. Yoga asana is very famous. People think that if I know how to take a breath, a thousand rupees, thousand rupees market, great spiritual guru who does marketing. Wrong. They have not even seen. First step only one person who reached there is Mahatma Gandhi. Yama is non-violence. First stage only he reached and then he practiced it. That's why Mahatma Gandhi became great. Pranayama 
Pranayama is very good, taking breaths, controlling. Pranayamena yuktena sarva roga samaraha. If you take a normal breathing good, you don't get any disease. I have no disease for last 30 years. 60 kilogram, no 59, no 61. Perfect. Ease, no dis, ease. No dis, ease, ease. Got it? With all these problems, they speak about health of different people. Got it? And they jump into the yogasana and pranayama straight, where your mind itself is in violence. Got it? No. God is within you, and our realization of God doesn't happen after some time closing your eyes and then doing this. Meditation in action. Look at meditation in action, Dr. D.P.S. There is a nice interview by somebody. When I was conducting a conference in Rishikesh for my Guru, my Guru is on meditation is Swami Rama, Swami Veda Bharati. Check these two people. You will see them teaching only one subject that is silence. How to be silent for life. Silent doesn't mean your manas is silent. Check me with an electroencelogram. My brain is not working. When I speak, my brain doesn't work because it doesn't come from the brain. It doesn't come from the heart. It comes from Atma. Got it? When you speak like that, your materialistic is not different from spiritual. Materialistic because there is a demand in the social life. That's why I said physically I have to be fit. I have to look good. Emotionally I must get controlled. Intellectually, I become sharp. These are all requirement. Intellectually sharp means I'll have to read, I'll have to write. You cannot just be spiritual and intellectually dull. So he lives in a society where he has to go and purchase books. To purchase book for reading, I need to have money. So without the desire, I cannot think about anything. Any detachment is after an attachment. If there is no attachment, there is detachment. Every sacrifice is after earning. What do I sacrifice if I don't have anything? Got it? So for everything, there is a starting point. Reaching all that, slowly graduating to a level where, do you like to have coffee? Okay. Do you want coffee? No. Will you take coffee? Yes. What is this? Yeah, yeah if it is there, okay. If it is not there, okay. That state is what is called the spirituality. It doesn't mean I will not enjoy a flower. I enjoy flower. But my attachment is not there. I hand over to somebody and say, Undaite Vendatari. Who have and have not. There are two groups. There is another group who had but left everything. You should have, then leave. Got it? That is spiritual. See, some Swamiji's don't understand this scientifically like this. They tape recorder their gurus and then speak. It's very difficult. That is our problem. But good. Therefore, you could ask a question, right? If you never heard, you will not be able to ask. Got it? Got it. Uh, one small thing is that you mentioned that uh, different organizations contributing around 20 percent. Achievement level is around 20 percent. No, only one. Uh, one department of space which is one great. Around. So, any organization, including ours also, we all have different, different level of thinking, different level of ability, delivery, knowledge, understanding. So, that would tell how to even if about 20 to 25 or 30 percent to increase. Uh, different layers are there, A grade, B grade, C grade, or how to motivate and uh, what we can do so that the uh, organization as a whole it should deliver. And the uh, percentage should be maybe 50 percent, 60 percent, maybe others are in the same problem. The energy level in which you work. The energy level you sit, energy level in which you move around, that will tell the organization's ability. It's very simple. At your home, a mother can be so fast moving, things ready, getting ready. Don't you do it when there is a marriage? When there is a function? Yes or no? Yes. So that's why I said tomorrow morning when you come, don't think it's the same office, same seat, same people. Change the attitude. Every day is a fresh day. 
today i have to do something great make every day different every day great some input tell that today i have done something different in my life i asked you a question but i'm sure it's very hard for people to say yeah in my whole service this day it happened like this how many such days you can create how many of you can look for such options <coughs> today i met somebody and this happened in my life nenu na bharat adana cinema bharat nenu na bharat nenu bharat nenu ha have you seen that movie what an about life yeah you don't see movies also <laughs> see that movie it makes lot of difference he says as a chief minister i can do great things you know correct or not there were lot of nadi actresses but maha nadi ek hi hai kyu i see all the movie on the release day i don't leave any movie there lot of great things to learn when you see that movie you know oh one chief minister can do this much and their office also can do much right take every day as a challenge nimisham jolitam sreyam nadu dhumayitum chiram nimisham jolitam sreyam nadu dhumayitum chiram don't live like a smoke live like a fire i did it in my office i remember you have vanishing blinds like this right when i wanted this to be in my, i made my own department in government i constructed my own office and uh, there was a uh, rule saying that this partition has to be this much for boss this much for i said no we will have only one hall everybody will sit let us meet each other every moment i have violated all the government rules i did it it needs lot of energy we go to director says no i cannot decide because government rules are this department the pwd should go i went to pwd we have got our own uh, construction department in so i went to there got chairman's permission in delhi when i went to office it was so rubbish no vanishing blind i said i want vanishing blind no clothes he said no the government rule cloth only i said we will change the rule you don't pay i will pay and put it no no you cannot do it who says i cannot do it in my room do all this then only i will come to my room otherwise i will be in library send all the files to library i will not enter the room all these have to be done so the director ke paas aisa room nahi hai i said no problem deputy director will have when i vacate let him sit in that room not sit i changed i went around all the departments got it done in government office i gave music to everybody we have got a production unit i gave music as them you music you can work because only a production job so we have to change rules sometimes that extra energy you have i think you can change a lot of things rules can be changed tn session for a productive output for a good purpose that's it so keep an extra energy with you no no sir you, you, i mean good that you said the second part of also had it been only first part no 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 <laughs> it was been difficult for us when change the rule for productive for productive purpose <laughs> for a productive purpose okay yeah okay. anybody else yeah kya sanjay yaar bol raha hai pooch lo na kuch aap kahan se Maharashtra. Maharashtra. Sir, he is one of the most energetic officers of our regional office. Yes. Maharashtra, where is it? Pune. Pune. Next week, I am in Aurangabad. Okay. Yeah. You can look at my website, read my poetry. It's all. You can download it. It's PDF server. Huh? Just type Dr. TPS, Dr. TPS, Temperature, Pressure, Second. All my books are life, L-I-F-E. This one civil service handbook, Life Made Simple, is a rhythm of life. This is Makers of India. These are all for me. Civil service aspirant students and all that. Most of them I write on life, L-I-F-E. Live in full enjoyment. full enjoyment yeah. but learn 
ലേൺ എൽ എൽ ഇ എ ആർ എൻ ആഫ്റ്റർ ലേണിംഗ് റിമൂവ് എൽ ഗുഡ് ഇനഫ്